Fell in blues, this is a traditional blues in E, so that means one, four, five. So that for us, that means uh, uh, an E, a, a B, and A. And this one also has a C part of the turnaround. Back to the E, back to the E. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold my E in this uh, E shape right here. And I'm just going to do the little lick with my pinky finger, like so. It's a dominant seven or a blue seven, which is a D, right? that goes off of my pinky finger off the third fret of the B string. So uh, to make the E, open E string, second fret of the A string, that's with my knowing finger, right? Uh, then second fret of the D string, that's an E again. Then first fret of the G string, that's a, uh, that's a G sharp, right? And there, if I play my uh, B string and my E string open, that's a regular E, but if I add that D on the B string at the third fret with my pinky finger right here, that makes uh, that makes the seven. So, and part of the lick is to move that shape down, right, down to the flat. So I'm at the flat seven, right, six, and then the five again. So third fret, second fret, open string. And that's really what it is. So now I'm playing open E, open E. Of the B string for the D, now to the C sharp, that's on the second fret of the B string, and then open B string and first fret of the G string, which is already here with my first finger holding that. So All right, not too hard. The A now I can get I can get an A uh, uh, flat seven. Just with the, my uh, finger holding down the uh, the A shape, and then my my third finger can go up on the third fret of the G, so that makes a seven right there. And then, and then back to the D. And now I've got that B seven, and I can do that by holding my first finger on the second fret of the uh, A string, and then the uh, second fret of the G string too. So one finger holding down both both of those notes. And a third finger is on the fourth fret of the D string. And pinky finger is on the fourth fret of the B string. Now if that's a, if that's a B, then all I gotta do is move everything up one step to get to the C. And back down to the B again. Move back down to the E again. So a lot of fun, not too hard, and even if you just weren't gonna do the rhythm and sing along to it, even that makes some sense. So have some fun. This is a great tune. It's a, a lot of fun. It's a good uh, campfire tune, I think. And uh, also it's a dead tune, as they say. And uh, so we'll have some fun with that.